Hi there, my name is JP, I'm from South Africa. Yo, <clears throat> I've been pondering on how to make this video for the last two weeks. Um, I've got a company called Vital Fit Supplements, I'm launching a website within a day, next day or two. And um, what my focus around this whole <clears throat> website and the posts and everything is, is to create, to help people to live healthier through dieting, training, uh, mental well-being, all those things. I think there's a lot of guys, a lot of people on the, on the internet, on YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, wherever, that, that does this. And I'm not saying that I'm anything different, but I do feel that everything that I've learned over the years, I can add a lot of value. I believe in simplicity, don't, do, don't go overboard, not swallowing a lot of pills, believing in trusting in natural ways of getting your, like for men, getting your testosterone levels right, for women, <clears throat> how to maintain the estrogen levels versus testosterone, like I'm not going to lie, women hormones, crazy, when I used to do personal training and train and prep people for competitions, the women were the most difficult, because with men, you can try something with a guy, and try it with another guy, and 9 out of 10 times, the recipe is more or less the same, women, all of them the same, they are different. They're not even the same. Yeah. It's it's a total roller coaster regarding that. But anyway, be it as it may. <clears throat> in in my business, I want to focus on healthy living, helping people to become more healthy, more active in their lifestyles, to be better, to live longer. You know, I read an article <clears throat> the other day where they said if you at the age of seventy can touch your toes you're still going to live for quite a few years because your mobility is good and I tried myself and oh I can touch my toes but the rest of the mobility wasn't there and it was crazy but be it as it may a little bit about myself um, I'm 41 years old at the moment living in South Africa I've got another business Naughty Mining and Logistics we specialize I'm a bearing specialist we on the we work on the mines and the mills, uh, mill inspection, bearing inspections, pl any plant work, mine work, anything like that. We've got the expertise and the people to do that, alignment, balancing, you name it, we can do it. <clears throat> but I've always been, I started training in 2000, 1996 and I've been training ever since. I was a skinny tall guy. Um, I think I had a, a what they call big anorexia. Um, no matter how big I get, I always feel small. And I managed to get naturally up to 130 kilos, quite big and lean. Well, not that lean, but I was quite big. And obviously went the other route, started doing some other things, got big, even bigger, 140 custom-made clothes. Uh, I remember my ex once say she struggled to find clothes that would fit the legs, neck, chest, shoulders, the whole titty. But I've always been into supplementation, training, helping people. I, did a, I had a business called Go Big Supplements um, <clears throat> and I really enjoyed it. Um, I just got to a point where <sighs> the problem is if you're in the fitness industry, um, it's a very selfish, selfish game. It's a very selfish industry. And because you, I worked with so many athletes and people that was all about me, myself and I, I just decided, no, stuff that, I'm going to get out of it, um, and something else also happened, I might talk about that at the later stage, um, and I decided to no, get out of it, and I started going into construction, and, um, well, basically anything, uh, I'm very blessed, God gave me the ability to be able to do almost anything if I really put my mind to it, and I'm very thankful for that, and, and it has brought me to where I am today. But I've always wanted to start making YouTube videos and starting to help people, but I am not a big social media person. I'll watch YouTube, I don't have Instagram, I don't have TikTok, I don't have Twitter, don't have Facebook, uh, any of those things. So for me to be able to make this video, it's totally out of my comfort zone. And um, I am a Christian, so if that offends anyone, I'm sorry about that, but I'm a Christian and I am here where I am today. Because I know God, God is alive, God lives, God is there. Uh, without God, 
I would not have been here where I am today talking to you guys and um, I'm going to be doing a 15 week challenge starting from Monday today Saturday starting from Monday um, where I'm going to start my end goal for this 15 week challenge is to basically get to 120 kilos I am around about 120 kilos at the moment uh, but my body fat is way too high I think I'm at 23, 24, 25% body fat and I want to get that down to 10% I don't want to compete or anything now my goal, I would love to do Masters over 40s against one of my friends um, but that's next year but for now I just want to challenge myself and put it out there I'm going to start I'll put on some videos or photos of what I look like now again going totally out of my comfort zone and exposing myself in that manner but I'm looking forward to the challenge and I'll be posting daily weekly I'll put or once a week I'll put one long video like this one and then every day I'll post something about training while I'm training dieting how I'm eating I'll post um, the the diet that I'm doing I want to say I'm going to necessarily be doing a diet but obviously I know what works for my body at this point in time and uh, I, I thrive on um, high protein, high protein, not so much fats but high proteins and a little bit of carbs maybe. I started doing the breakfast smoothies in the morning, um, some strawberries, raspberries, apple with my protein powders, Greek yogurt, a little bit of milk and water and that seems to be working for me but otherwise mostly protein. Um, I'll be doing my blood works as well, testosterone levels, cholesterol, sugar, all those kind of things. Uh, now, in the middle and at the end again, and um, to see where we're at, and um, how the, and I'll take you on the journey with me. Obviously, our work um, it might be the festive season. Um, my business partner, they are going away on holiday, so I need to be at the office and at the business to make sure that if there's any work coming in that we can sure sort it out and help the clients and obviously I do the supplementation as well. I'm only selling protein at the moment. Um, Precision Health, it's a local brand from True South Africa from uh, some company in Cape Town that I've been, well I was their first client in 2002, 2003, somewhere like that and I've, ever, I've been this top seller <coughs> for a long time. and. Um, yeah, so I'm promoting that, and as soon as there is some other products created in this BCAs, Tribulus, Natural Testosterone, Testosterone Booster, and it's got uh, fat burners for women and so on as well, but I'll do start doing that in other stages. And um, yeah, that is pretty much it in a nutshell. I'm really looking forward to, to start doing this. I really hope I get people that is interested and actually enjoys what I'm doing and starts following me on the journey and join me on the journey. And uh, the comments will be open so if people want to comment on what they think and what they want to do and want to be part of it. Uh, I'm going to be on Facebook and Instagram as well. I'm not going to do the TikTok thing as of yet. But um, yeah, I'm going to be starting with that and then take it from there. But I really hope you guys will enjoy this journey with me and um, yeah let's see what happens like I posted a short yesterday and everything in life I feel happens for a reason as long as we keep on moving forward and <clears throat> something that I'm while I'm busy talking now I just realized also something that for us to prosper to move forward and to be good or better better versions of ourselves we need to do things that out of our comfort that takes us out of our comfort zones and um, that's not always nice or lacquer in that sense but it takes you out of your comfort zone and it's uncomfortable but it's fine to be uncomfortable because if you start doing things that you believe in God will bless you and always have faith have faith trust and something else just something I feel I have to say is just be mindful, you are the average of the five closest people surrounded, you surround yourself with. So if you, if you out of the top five people you surrounded with, up out of, with most of the time, and um, more than half of that people is negative and not in a good space, that's going to affect your life in a bad way as well. And no matter, believe me, I'm a strong-willed person, I've got a strong uh, 
a strong person mentally and physically as well. But believe me, if you've got too many negative people in your life, they do bring you down. And I promise, I promise you, it's difficult to get out from sometimes. And um, yeah, make sure you surround yourself with the right people. I'm making changes in my life. God spoke to me this week and I'm making drastic changes and going out on a limb, doing a lot of things that I'm obviously not comfortable, which includes this, doing this, but I'm looking forward to it. It's going to be fun. And uh, if you guys want to know more about the things that God wants me to do, I'll talk about it. Um, and I'm looking forward to this. Guys, I hope you have an awesome day. Cheers.